Today on X-Play. Oh. Pain and suffering with WWE WrestleMania 21. Plus, Adam meets big people who hurt each other for money. You gotta watch X-Play. And we review Midnight Club 3 Dove Edition. This man scares us. RVD. It's game time. Where's the party? Cause it ain't with Adam Sessler and Morgan Webb. It's a party. Speak for yourself, Sessler. Hello and welcome to this festive edition of X-Play. We have wrestling. We have wrestlers. We have a role-playing game with some amazing hand-drawn art and an impressive anime pedigree. Ooh. Plus, more games under $20 for the cheap bastard. It's all of us. And last, but not least, finally, there's a good street racing game. But we begin with one of the biggest wrestling games of the year. Oh, God, why? People love wrestling. <laughs> we understand that. Well, I mean, we like waving fake lightsabers around. Uh, yeah, everybody has their embarrassing thing. And for wrestling fans, the thing in 2005 is the release of WrestleMania 21 for the Xbox. But is it worth your hard-earned money? Oh, we'll tell you in our review whether you like it or not. Hmm, if it's a day of the week, that means we've got a new wrestling game to review. And this one is titled, shockingly, WWE WrestleMania XXI. That means it's the 21st WrestleMania and possibly the 21st time we've seen a wrestling game this year. How about slowing down on the product, WWE? That's not a joke either, because this game doesn't cut it. But wrestling fans are a loyal breed, similar to Gilmore Girl fans. So they may not appreciate these harsh words. I know what that feels like, and it don't feel good. It's what we call tough love. Deal with it. At least there's a nice array of wrestlers in the game, and they do look halfway decent, don't they? Hey, there's the big show. Or as he'll be known in 15 years, the big massive heart attack. If that happens before this segment airs, we apologize in advance but we wouldn't be surprised. Let's have a look at a few of the wrestlers in the game. Oh. All right, I can hear you wrestling fans out there getting more and more angry at us. You think we don't like wrestling. You think we don't care about you. We hope this will ease your troubled mind. Start your salivating in three, two, one. Don't say we never gave you anything. You'll get all the wrestling action you apparently need with two-man action, four-way action, and of course, more of this. It's all just a matter of been there, done that. Nothing new has been added for your wrestling dollar. You know, if the WWE isn't going to try and entertain, then neither are we. For one night and one night only, X-Play presents the match you've been waiting never for. The Amazing Masked Wrestler versus The Bear. They've hated each other for seconds and now they'll prove it in the ring. The Amazing Masked Wrestler versus The Bear. It's gonna be hot, 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 hot. Let me think if we covered everything. Bad gameplay? Check. Lazy presentation? Check-a-rama. Totally average AI? Check-a-rooney. But it's wrestling and apparently that's all that matters. We give WWE WrestleMania 21 two what could have been out of five. We know this game is selling well, but spare yourself the agony and don't waste your money on it. It hurts me to say this, but even Rumble Roses is a better game than WrestleMania 21. If you want a decent wrestling game, try Ultimate Muscle Legends versus New Generation. Or one of the WWE SmackDown games. I know WrestleMania may have the wrestlers you like, but it also has deeply flawed gameplay, and that is not worth blowing your hard-earned money on. Look, we're sorry we didn't like the game, so to make it up to the wrestling fans, we sent Adam to a WrestleMania party <laughs> to interview some real wrestlers. As you can guess, there's a bit of a size difference. Enjoy. <laughs> So here we are with Rob Van Dam. I just want to ask you first off, I'm the host of a show called X-Play. Have you ever heard of the show? 
I'm here with Big Show, who definitely earns every bit of his name. Uh, sh should I call you Mr. Show? You and, 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 and your fellow compadres, you professionally beat the crap out of one another. Yet you're a very nice person. Explain. You know what? You need a little bit of the sassiness, the sexiness. When you look at your sea of admirers out there, what do you see? I see 99% of the population because no matter where I go, if I'm in a Waffle House in Georgia or off the highway. Along with being a little dirty, a little sweet. Or if I'm at the Staples Center in Los Angeles, California, it doesn't matter. You I like video games. I love video games. I really? I have them in the house. I would stay up all night playing them. You got to be a diva. You got to throw it all in the pot. See, this is like the modern American family. It's all different and screwy. And they say, RVD, RVD, RVD. So, I mean, do, do you sit around and like darn while she plays video games? No. Oh, I work out. She's upstairs yeah, playing video games. Be best friends, worst enemy with the people all at the same time. Now it's funny in, in that whole kind of you know potpourri of, of, of things to have. You 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 didn't say doofus, and that's what I do. You can count on the fact that the best match was going to be Rob Van Dam versus whoever. And when you walk in, a lot of people booed. What is that like? That's like getting cheered for me. The greatest athletic wrestling phenomenon that's ever been in the industry. Oh, you're a phenomenon. It's Thursday night. People send me emails. They say that I'm retarded. So, I mean, uh, I was going to say something, but I kind of felt bad for you. Back to the hands. Just just, just so the viewers at home can have some sort of contrast here. Can you even hold a controller in that hand? Over time, do you get used to it? Being retarded? No, 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 Rob. Well, I'm going to lose. How did you achieve this level of modesty? At what point do you justify kicking someone in the nuts? Uh, there are no rules in fighting. I'm guessing that you, you'd get your ass kicked, but I would still respect you for your courage. Now, when you're RVD, your courage comes from knowing what you bring to the table. What you need to do is just, you know, know that you and I, we are extraordinary people. So. Knowing that you've kicked so many asses over the last 15 years, you got a great chance of beating your opponent, no matter who he is. And we have to be thankful that there's ordinary people out there in order to make us extraordinary. So thank you. That's what it's like being RVD. It's, 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 it's just, you're, you're like the Deepak Chopra of ass kicking. You just, you don't make lemonade out of a lemon, you make like a lemon meringue pie. But the thing to remember is that everybody's the same size when they're laying on their back. That's, okay. I can go from any corner of the ring because I can cover the whole thing. I can turn when I'm in the air. I can turn this way. Words of inspiration for the young people just whose eyes are like saucers right now, gazing at you. They still plant you with 240 pounds of muscle. Kabam! Remember, everything you say will have a huge impact on them. Don't be a putz. When I hit you with the five-star frog splash while you're holding your penis, you are going to be the loser, and I will be the victor. One, two, three. It's a proven fact, brother. You know, I once stapled myself in the crotch. Okay. X-Play, you gotta watch X-Play. If you wanna know what's going on in the video game world, you gotta watch X-Play. You feeling me? I'm feeling you. Oh, I feel that. I feel that. Thank you. Maybe you should quit holding your penis. Okay. Well, Kurt, I've never discussed my privates with another man to this degree, and... I'm not sure I like it. I don't know how I feel about it either. I think we're gonna have to go our separate ways. I'm cool with that. But it was a pleasure. All right. So uh, real nice that you called Rob Van Dam Kurt, considering RVD only said his own name to you about, like, I don't know, a million times. I was scared because he kept talking about my penis. I'm scared that you're talking about it right now. Oh, my.